Hey guys, so I'm just getting ready to go work out and I'm gonna work later too, but first and foremost, we're going to work out because I'm really starting to see results on the scale and just in the mirror. So like, I'm definitely staying consistent. I don't know what's been up with me like <laughs> this past year, like all of 2023, I feel like I've just been way more consistent with working out. Back in the day, like, yeah, I would just not even try to be consistent like i would literally work out like once or twice and just stop <laughs> but now like i feel like i've really been working out just about every day so yeah um it's crazy because it's like my weight kind of i hate to say goes up and down because it's nothing drastic at all um the highest i've ever been was like 185 like during my pregnancy <clears throat> but i even like after i had the baby i lost weight and i dropped to like probably 170 something and then i kind of gained back the weight so then i was like 180 again but i was like you know laying around all day breastfeeding staying in the house you know i had just transitioned over into a driving job so like i have a lot of excuses for the weight gain but now i'm you know kind of getting back down to where i want to be my um goal weight is like 155 that probably still sounds pretty big to most people but i'm cool like i'm not trying to go back to you know 125 and stuff like that um i like having a little thickness <laughs> So right now, I'm um, 169. Let me show y'all. All right, so I'm forgetting that I literally just got dressed and I ate today. So it's saying 171 right now, but this morning it was like 169.8 or something like that. So I'm trying to get down to 155, even 160 may be okay. But I have to see... <coughs> <coughs> so I'm going to try to lose this next little 8.5, 9 pounds and see what happens. Um, I'm already pretty happy with where I am. I just want to tone up a little bit more. But let me show y'all how I look. Because <laughs> um, I know that's like what most people are concerned with. Just, you know, the overall appearance. I don't know why I'm like lifting my arms up, but I guess I'm trying to let y'all see like my stomach. Let y'all see like my stomach. So I have like a little, you know, a little fat, but whatever. I have a new colored bra, so that wasn't just boobs y'all were seeing that was like a brown bra. Um, But yeah. I'm loving the results. I have definitely seen myself, <laughs> not a lot bigger, but like, yeah, like definitely 15 pounds heavier than this. So I'm good. Like, I feel like people literally stopped approaching me, like stopped flirting with me. And it wasn't like something that I cared about because Honestly, I was getting tired of everybody like, you know, flirting, flirting, flirting all the time. So I was actually enjoying it, but I also was like, well, what's going on? Cause something <laughs> like something is definitely different because I used to walk out my door. Like I'm not even trying to brag. I'm really not like, I really think it's kind of weird. Cause I feel like I look pretty average. Like I look like, you know just about everybody else <laughs> so i'm not like trying to brag at all but like so many people used to like beep and flirt and like you know try to holla every day it was literally like maybe six to seven people a day <laughs> like on average so 
that just kind of dropped down to zero and I'm like, hold up, like what's going <laughs> what's going on? Cause like something had to change. I know I've gotten older and stuff. So like maybe people just want like, you know, those real young girls, like 19, 20, whatever. And people seem to think that I'm younger than I really am anyway. So like maybe people that were seeing me a couple of years ago thought that I was like, you know, 17, 18 or something, but I really wasn't. Yeah, anyway, I just noticed a decline of, you know, the beeping and, you know, the flirting. And I think that's just changed overall over the years. Like people just don't act as thirsty. I also feel like online dating is kind of like rising. So I feel like a lot of men don't really flirt in person anymore because they know they could just literally, you know, click a few buttons and like meet somebody. But yeah, anyway, I noticed a decline in the people that were like trying to talk. But now it's like I see it going back up. Um like now it'll be like two or three people a day <laughs> and this is such an odd formula to be using now i see a lot of people staring but i'm just talking about like actually approaching me or like beeping and stuff like <laughs> i feel like everybody kind of mentally has that in their head like maybe not maybe it's just me but that's not anything that's ever gonna like make or break me attention but at the same time, I do notice little changes or whatever, because that's something that, you know, used to be so, you know, emphasized in the past. So now it's like, okay, what's going on? Hey, uh, do you ever wonder, like, what is going on? I mean, like, do you ever, like, wake up or do, uh, like, do something and you're just like, what the fuck is going on? So basically, I was like, let me get it together because something has definitely changed but i mean of course you know like okay when you have a baby you're not gonna look the same um when you get older you're not gonna look the same so like yeah i was always still you know confident or whatever i don't feel like people beeping or men define me and how i feel about myself but at the same time i do you know, really like my body. So I want to take care of it. Um, I feel like I like the way that I look with, you know, certain clothing or whatever. And I'm definitely not trying to just let that, you know, slip away like, oh, whatever. I'm just going to lay in the bed all day. No. So yeah, we got to <laughs> keep it going with these workouts because um, if not, I know it could just, you know, be like down the drain so anyway i'm going to work out and then i'm gonna start working so yeah oh and today i ate some grapes a banana and a bottle of water so i'm trying to be healthier um last night i ate like two taco salads and I did make an Italian wrap because they're bomb. I'll put the picture right here on the screen because I took a few pictures. But um, I know that maybe wasn't, yeah, it definitely wasn't the healthiest, but it was bomb, so it was worth it. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to like eat better and eat healthier. I'm pretty decent with that anyway because I pretty much cook like 99.3% of all my food in the house. I don't eat out often at all. Um, I probably eat out like 10 times a year. So out of 365 days, I only eat out like 10 times. So yeah, like I cook everything at home. So, you know, I'm pretty, you know, proud of that fact or whatever. But, um, yeah, anyway, let me go ahead because I'm ready to start walking now. Um, I should have downloaded some new music, but... I'm just gonna play the music that I do have and put in my AirPods. So yeah, I'll see y'all when I get out there.
leaving Goodwill. I don't even know if I told you about, but after I left the gym, I took a walk and now I'm just stopping in here. I found some curtains. They're more like drapes. They're like the, you know, really quality curtains. So they were like $7, but I was like, <laughs> I'm still just gonna get them because curtains are expensive, so. And it's like, you know, a pretty wide set, so. These are a pretty unique color. I'll put it on the screen. But these are like a bronze looking, you know, brownish color. I don't even want to say copper because that sounds ugly, but like <laughs> they're like a bronzy brown, I feel like. So, um, I'm so hungry and I don't understand. Well, I didn't really eat that much. I ate literally one banana, about 20 grapes and drink a bottle of water. So I don't know why I'm acting like, <laughs> I don't understand why I'm hungry, but yeah, I'm about to go home and eat. Before I go in the house, I'm gonna run in this library and get my son some more books. Um, we haven't got any books from the library in a second, so <sighs> gonna go in here, pick out about 10 books, take them home, and then I could just go ahead and eat before I like clean them because it takes a minute to clean the books. So, yeah. But I couldn't, you know, just keep driving past without grabbing him some more books. All right, we got the goods. Hold on. The next day. Hey guys, so I'm headed to the gym. Um, I'm drinking some water real fast. And then I'm going to go ahead, head out the door. Um, I need to stop at the beauty supply and get a larger hair clip. Because this one is just annoyingly small, like... So yeah, I'm gonna get like a medium size one. I have some really big ones like, you know, this big, but that's like overkill. But this one is not big enough, so I want it to be like this. So yeah, I gotta stop at a beauty supply and then I'm going to go to the gym. Let me show y'all the books that I um got my son yesterday too. I already wiped all of these by the way and cleaned them. So, Strictly No Elephants, Chief Rhino to the Rescue, Monsters Don't Eat Broccoli, A Space for Me, A Day with No Words, The Thing About Spring, Graduation Groove, You Are Not Small, all for pie, pie for all, <clears throat> and the camping trip. But yeah, I know he's about to be excited when he, um, you know, discovers that he has more books. I already took him some lunch or whatever you want to call it, breakfast, because he's still asleep. But I already took him some breakfast to my mother's house so that when he wakes up, he can have that ready. I used to call me on my cell phone. Late night when you need my love Call me on my cell phone Late night when you need my love Call me on my cell phone
I'm just trying to show you all these new curtains and the color that they are. Um, these are the ones I found at Goodwill. Um, I really like them. Like, I'm surprised that I like them because they are kind of a warmer tone. But it's not like an overwhelming warmth. Hey guys, so I'm in my kitchen. Um, I'm starting to hate how my kitchen island is looking. It's looking too cluttered and colorful for me. Y'all know I like my spaces to be like neutral colored. So what I'm about to do is clean all of these. I had to like find these around my house. Um, and now I'm about to clean them and put them under here. So I know that's gonna take a while, but it's worth it because this is getting on my nerves all right so i got it cleared off now i'm just cleaning it because this gets really dusty for some reason so look how dusty that is This level really gets dusty. Oh my God. That's disgusting. All right, so this is how it looks now. I know it's still a little colorful under there, but that's fine. That doesn't bother me as much as it was before. Um, and I could honestly put this stuff inside of there. This is where I had my seasonings before, but this is like a little lazy Susan. So that's like more useful in the kitchen. So I'm trying to just leave it like that. But if it starts to bother me, I can always just put it back into this basket with the lid. So yeah. Yeah. picking up an order. This lady almost got cursed the f out. <laughs> Cause she, first of all, she's rude. Second of all, she comes behind the counter, takes a sip of whatever she was drinking, soda or something, and then walks past me and burps to the point that now I can smell the fucking soda. I'm like, you know what? I could tell when people just want to start drama and make you look like the crazy person. So I didn't even say anything. Like it wasn't in my face, but it was like over here, like behind my head or whatever as she was walking past. And I'm just like, you know, let me just not even do it because I want to do this trip. I mean, it's um, paying a nice amount. So I'm like, let me not even do it. Cause I know they would try to like <laughs> throw me out. <laughs>